Okay, so Brad and I have a permission to do this early 1900s farm. Not sure the exact year, but there's an old foundation here, and apparently over here there used to be a well. So we're gonna bust out our metal detectors and see what we can find. Well, I probably won't show you a ton of junk, but I do like to show the first find. No matter what it is, old shotgun shell. Wow, that's a neat relic. So that looks to be the top to something. It's definitely some sort of lid to, I don't know, makeup or something. Neat. Yeah, so I cleaned the bottom out and it actually has glass in there. It's a really neat old relic. Brad's saying he thinks he's got some silver. What do you mean, might? That's for sure silver. Yeah, it looks like a barber dime. One dime. Oh, man. <laughs> barber. Sweet. Later. 1914. All right. On the silver. Dang. Good job. We haven't been here very long either. D mint mark. That's so sweet. On the board. Let's see what I got here. I don't know. Oh, it's another kind of cap thing. Boy, I thought that was going to be a button. Hmm. All right, let's keep going. Brad's using the manicure. He says he thinks he might have another coin. Oh yeah, he does. That's gonna be an Indian too, I bet. Yeah, I think you got yourself an Indian head penny there, buddy. Nope, <laughs> clad dime. Clad dime. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! <laughs> And hey, it was the <laughs> coin. <laughs> Did I give you that coin or back? Yes. Oh, that sounds like it's a big piece of something. Wow, Brad thinks he might have like... A piece of iron. Oh, well, sounds like about a Porsche? silver quarter or a half dollar to me. What does it say on there? Well, it just gives me a number. Excellent. <laughs> this is exciting, you guys. <laughs> Yeah, Brad's gonna do a live dig here. <laughs> yeah, that's something cool. Yeah, I don't hear any iron or anything in that. That sounds... Nope, oh, that's pretty crisp. Yeah, I think that might be a silver quarter or silver half. Uh-oh. Now what happens when you work together? Do you split the profits here? Or oh, what? no, no. He he give you a, will you give him a nickel? No, he digs it, he owns it. Oh, <laughs> I love it. Oh, Bazinga. what a great Bazinga. piece of... Oh, this was a cup, you guys. Yeah, for sure. A little cup. Here you go. Horse stepped on it. Fix, fix that up and drink out of it. Sure look good on the screen, though. Uh, aluminum num, right? It says USA on the handle. Oh, does it? See, I don't have my glasses. Oh, boom. That might have been a, an old army cup, then. I'm not really sure what this is going to be. Some sort of old... And a ladle handle, I guess. I don't know, it's pretty heavy duty. It's iron, so. Yeah, maybe it's something else. It's definitely broke, though. Well, they got me a part of a alarm clock or something. First token of the day. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. <gasps> Look at that. Oops. Good for two and a half cents in trade. I can't read it upside down. That's right. I got a close up here for this second. With Is the that a camera? camera. Well, let me get out of your way. Let yeah, just... we like. I'm we, so excited. We film these for uh, for YouTube. Three and a third cents on that side. Oh. <laughs> Three and a third. Well, looks like I got myself a little spoon bowl here. I don't think it's sterling. Maybe. 
No. That's definitely plated. So I'm thinking this. So I think it's plated, but you see that divot right there? I'm starting to think it's been shot. So I'm going to use it for target practice. Well, there's my first button. It's like a little suspender button. Dang, I'm thinking live dick here. Let's see what we got. Don't want to hit it. Maybe this thing. What is that? Oh, that's something fancy. Let me uh, clean that sucker up. I'm not exactly sure what it's off of, but it's definitely fancy. I well, hope you can see the little flower pattern on there and stuff. So that's probably an old brooch or hair hair clip. I guess it could possibly be like an escutcheon of some kind. Neat. So I believe that's a scale piece. And let's see what we say. This is Chatillion's Balance, New York. All right, we've kind of moved away from that foundation. Um, now we're trying the apple orchard. Well, I finally got a coin, but it's a glad penny. All right, just got me a 1944 Weedy. That's the way you always recheck the hole. There's actually two of them. See if I can get a date. Yeah, I can't tell for sure, but it's 40 something, I think. Well, that was a fun hunt. It's pretty rare when you have the opportunity to actually metal detect with the person who gave you permission. Man, she was excited. That was super cool. She wanted to see every single thing that came out of the ground and what a fun day. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed it. See you on the next one.